was always my dream to be able to drive a motorcycle on my own. I proved it to everyone at the racetrack that I could drive a motorcycle by myself. Now it is time to begin the long ride back to Ocean City, Maryland. Hi Cody, I'm so glad you could make it here today. Thanks Natalie for having me here today. It has been a long hot ride getting here from Florida. Why did you want to create a motorcycle for people who are blind? I always wanted to create a motorcycle for blind people so I can ride by myself wherever I want to go and do what I want to do. What special modifications does the motorcycle have? I have laser sensors on my bike to detect things around me such as cars and guard guardrails. Also when I get up to speed my throttle stops so I don't go too fast. I have a special computer that sends messages to the headset in my helmet. How else does the bike work? The bike works the same as a regular motorcycle but with special modifications. How long have you been riding motorcycles? I have been riding motorcycles since I was one years old but I am always on the back and never driving the bike until recently. What have people said to you about this idea? People are always telling me I couldn't do it by myself, but I wouldn't let them get in the way of my dream. I was determined to find a way to modify the motorcycle so I could drive. How do you feel about riding the bike? I feel great because I am the first blind person to be able to drive a motorcycle on the road all by myself. Hopefully, this will encourage other blind people to follow their dream and do things they never thought was possible. Now that I can drive the cycle by myself, I feel free and independent. Wow, what an inspirational story. Thank you so much for taking your time to talk to us today. Thank you, Natalie, for having me here today. This is Natalie Bland. Have a great day.